Hi there, in this video we're going to look at burning in subtitles like you see below into a movie. Okay, uh, I apologize for the terrible audio. Uh, my mic's up in another room and there's a baby sleeping and I'm not going in there to get it. So we're going to deal with crappy audio for this video, but let's go off and burn our subtitles in. And I've just spent all day trying to make this happen, so I kind of making this video for myself for later on because there's no way I'm going to remember. And also for you if you are, <laughs> you could save a day's work. Alright, so I've got this MP4, there's no subtitles on it at the moment. Okay, it's just me talking. Okay, but I need to put my Chinese subtitles. So, I've had somebody create my Chinese subtitles, here they are. Okay, a .srt file. But if I open them up in something like TextEdit, okay, you'll notice that it's all this kind of like just mixed up language. So, to fix that in TextEdit, what we can do is in TextEdit, go to Preferences, and the one that says, uh, where is it, Open and Save, go to this one that says Opening Files, and say, let's open files in Simplified Chinese. So I'm using mainland Chinese, Simplified Chinese. You might have to change yours depending on what kind of Chinese you're using. So Simplified Chinese, great. Close that down, and I've found this might be just me doing hooju. I've been at it all day, but if I close everything out and close down um, text edit, so there's no text edit open, then open it from it. I find that, ta-da, okay, uh, it's all in the right characters. So that's phase one of many phases. Okay, so we've got this guy, now we need to save it. So what happens in um, text edit, if you go to, there's no save as, there's a duplicate, and then if you give it that name there, okay, uh, and hit enter, it's going to save it as the wrong encoding. Okay, so I just kind of like ignore it and just click anywhere else. Then if I try and close it, it's going to say, would you like to save it? And then you get this thing here, what kind of encoding. And we want to change it from simplified Chinese to this one here, UTF-8. Turns out that can handle the characters that we need as well. So I'm going to call mine ut UTF-8, you don't need to add that, okay, I'm just giving it another file name so I don't ruin the initial one. I'm going to call that an SRT, otherwise it doesn't, it gives it a TXT file, okay, so we're getting there. Use SRT, great, great, close that one down. So I've got this new file here, he's the one I'm going to use. Now, to burn it in, okay, I can't seem to make this work in Premiere Pro, it doesn't seem to, subtitling in Premiere Pro is terrible. Um, so what we're going to do is something called Handbrake. Okay, Handbrake is free. It's awesome. It's a little encoding program. Opens up and it says which file you want to work on. I'm going to find that file here. That's the file that I want to add. Okay, click open. Then I skip along to subtitles. Then I click from tracks and I go to add external SRT. Okay, and I go and find that SRT. Where is it? There, the one I've made. There it is there. Okay, click open. I'm going to burn it in, and I'm going to make sure it's Chinese. I'm going to make sure this encoding matches my UTF-8. And then I'm going to kick back, and oh, over here, um, uh, this this is going to go really fast, just because I'm using a tutorial. If you want to kind of, um, yeah, it's going to make a really small file, okay, and the quality is not going to be as good. You might go up to some of these larger ones here, depending on your original quality. Okay, so I'm going to leave mine at fast. Hit start, kick back, relax. I'm going to speed this up in post-production and go. Okay, we're back. Nearly at the end there. Um, while that's finishing off, you can add to queue. So if you've got lots to be done, okay, you can keep adding them to the queue and not till hit start until you've kind of queued up all 50 videos. Okay, and it'll, it'll take forever still, but um, at least you won't have to do them individually. Okay, now moment of truth. Where is this file there. Where did I save it? I have no idea. In the wrong folder. So I'm going to go and find it in that wrong folder. I put it in here by accident. Okay. Uh, oh, it's okay. I'm in the wrong folder. Hi, my name is Dan. Hey! hey. Chinese subtitles. ...by becoming a UX designer. I built this course for web designers... And yes, you did. Designers. All right, that's going to be it. If you found it useful and you got yours to work, like and subscribe so that other people can find this um, and save their days from trying to burn in subtitles. And if you want to check out more of my stuff, bringyourownlaptop.com is all of my videos. And there's also motion graphics and video editing and web design and graphic design, all that sort of stuff. Go check out that. Um, all right, that is how to burn in Chinese subtitles. Oh yeah, and I apologize for the terrible audio as well. Um, my mic's in the other room, and I was too lazy to get it for this one. 
all right. see you later. bye.